February 28, December 2013, a father with two little daughters came. After checking out the internet, to have his uh, hamster treated. Apparently, the swelling on the nose happens just two days ago. And uh, as you can see, the hamster is breathing very rapidly, very fast. So, it must be quite painful. Also, it's not only thing. Today, January 4, 2014. It's around seven days after hospitalization and treatment. As you can see, the hamster's nose is not so swollen. In fact, it is back to almost normal. Two days ago, the hamster abscess had ripened and uh, so I put her under anesthesia and make a cut along the bridge of the nose, which you can see. But the lower part of the nose, the tip of the nose, was already rotten. And the pus is all deep inside the, the nose, as you can see from the illustration. And uh, that was two days ago. After that, yesterday, the hamster looked very weak and uh, so I thought she might be not able to survive. So I gave her dextrosaline plus betrayal subcutaneous yesterday and of course had the nose cleaned out of the blood clot. This will be seen in another video and uh, after that Today the hamster looks much better but it's still very uh, weak after the surgery. Before surgery, she, she was quite active but then the, the nose had a big swelling which is past underneath. The past is ripened and that's why I was able to lance it and take out the Pass. And so, you can, as you can see from the illustration, the red line is where I cut, and the whole, whole nose was really bloody. So the hamster was done on the 2nd of January, which is two days ago, and today, as you can see, it's not really, it's not really that active. It's not really that active, but uh, they're still alive. The eyes are closed. So the owner has to do nursing, put eye drops, and give oral electrolytes, and uh, get the hamster to recover. The hamster has been here for at least seven days, so it will be too costly if it stays on. Now I advise the owner, not to use this bowl, deep bowl. Just put the food straight onto the onto the floor, and also to use tissue paper and and uh, don't use the the hamster house, the porcelain type, because this hamster loves to loves to sleep inside urinate and poo inside this hamster house which is a porcelain uh, house with uh, ears usually common in Singapore hamster housing this hamster doesn't have a bath, sand bath because the eyes become red so sand bath will stop some time and go now as to the cause of the nose being uh, being uh, swollen, I suspect some sharp seeds inside this uh, deep bowl where the hamster has to go in to, to pick up the seeds and eat had penetrated into the nose. Over time, it became infected 
and so so the nose became swollen and hardened it needs a uh, anti-inflammatory and vitriol for the first two or three days to bring down that uh, swelling bring down the the hardened hardened uh, inflammation and it, it happened three day, uh, two days ago so I was able to lance abscess but the effect effect of this uh, surgery is quite the serious on this hamster as you can see he's not very active so his eyes are closed again you see the other video which I have posted on the internet he was actually eating a bit with a swollen nose on the bridge full of pus but he looks much more livelier than now unfortunately the pus had to be lanced otherwise uh, this hamster will not recover well so today 11 am January 4, 2014 as wanted to bring the hamster home and uh, let her recover slowly and uh, this is what the hamster's house actually the water bottle is quite good and uh, the hamster has lost a lot of weight so what I do is uh, to put him back in and uh, he should recover slowly over the next 10 days with proper nursing and feeding by the owner so he'll be coming today to pick up the hamster and bring it bring her home but definitely this bowl should be taken away and not used anymore for this hamster in fact all these deep bowls are quite common in uh, Singapore for hamster owners to use January 4214 Saturday top by vets close closing the case on the hamster with big swollen nose and wet tail there's no more wet tail and uh, I expect this hamster to survive and live